Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can use the TradingView mobile app to place orders. So let's get right into it. Now, firstly, TradingView is a very useful application slash website slash service, which you can use to analyze data, view super, super charts of anything that you're interested in to trade. And you can also use it to connect to a broker and actually make trades yourself. Uh, you can use demo trades or you can use real trades and actually trade with real money. Uh, and there is a lot of things you can also create your own watch list and there is a lot of things you can do but in this tutorial as i said i'll be explaining to you guys how you can order via the mobile app so let's get right into it now uh, in the mobile app uh, it is a bit different and i'm explaining this through an article on the training view official support tab uh, since my mobile phone is currently out of service so uh yeah uh, to begin all you have to do uh, is you can turn on instant orders placement if you would so like all you have to do is just click on these three uh, dots in the bottom right corner if you're on a chart for any uh, anything that you're looking to trade on and once you click that this menu will pop up uh, just uh, you can also enable the buy sell buttons which is perfect for this and you can also uh, click instant orders uh, if it is enabled uh, orders will be placed skipping the order panel uh, once you tap the buy sell buttons and they can also be enabled in the training set settings as you can see here and once you enable them uh, the context menu uh, is also not, not supported for mobile apps uh, however you can use the plus button on the price scale to place pending orders uh, and you can enable the plus button on the gear icon here in the bottom right. Uh, however, to place orders, all you have to do is click on one of these buttons. The red one is for selling, the blue one is for buying. And once you click them, you can just uh, buy or sell whatever you would like. You can also, as I've said, turn on instant orders and it'll just uh, disable the order view. Uh, you can also, as I've said, click on the plus button and add an order for the future. And that is pretty much all you have to do. To modify them, all you have to do is find them on the chart, click them, and you can edit them uh, however you want for the order is actually placed and that's all you have to do hope you guys enjoyed and i'll be seeing you guys next time